Thank you. Just this morning, the Finance Committee of this Parliament was questioning the Deputy First Minister and the Permanent Secretary about the complete lack of transparency of decision-making when it comes to the spending of public money. And, of course, Ferguson Marine is the prime example of this problem. It's exactly the same view that is held by the Auditor-General. So can I ask the Cabinet Secretary, what action is he going to take within his Cabinet role to ensure that a scandal of this nature never, ever happens again? Cabinet Secretary. Well, well, in terms of transparency, uh, obviously I'm making a statement to Parliament at the very first opportunity after the decision has been taken. I'm offering myself to scrutiny to Liz Smith uh, and to other colleagues in terms of the decision that I've been taking, which I think is the right one uh, for ensuring that we have a future for the yard and ensuring our island communities uh, are served uh, by good uh, vessels in as timorous a fashion uh, as possible. Of course, there are lessons to be learned quite clearly in terms of uh, the delays, the unacceptable delays and the unacceptable it cost overruns. We have been upfront uh, about that and we continue to work hard with Ferguson's uh, and our other uh, interests to ensure that these uh, situations don't happen again. Uh, and I'll continue to make sure that I offer myself uh, to Parliament uh, for scrutiny on the decisions that we are taking.